Quito, 20 kilometers south of the equator, is the highest capital city in the world. With a population of 2.7 million, the city is situated in a narrow valley in the Andes, surrounded by volcanoes. Quito's historic center is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The Central Bank and the Presidential Palace were built around 200 years ago. Both are impressive examples of colonial architecture. Quito seemed pretty gloomy to me, but that could be because my iPhone was stolen here. Here the thief makes his getaway. The streets strictly follow the checkerboard pattern imposed by the Spanish crown. Quito is a city of street art, with lots of expressive graffiti. Street vendors try to make money somehow. If you look hard enough, you can even find an original painting by Hieronymus Bosch in a Franciscan monastery in Quito. No one knows how it got there. Quito is a city strongly influenced by the Roman Catholic faith. There are many beautiful churches in the colonial Baroque style. A lot of money has been invested in the interior of the churches here, money probably lacking elsewhere. Our highlight in Quito was a visit to the Ministry of Cultural Heritage with Humboldt's stunning original writings. Erst ab Quito hat er seine Hauptschreibweise auf Französisch verändert. Da musste noch mal an das und das denken, da gab es ja auch die Vulkane und, und hat das aufgezeichnet und hat das dann äh, in seinen Unterlagen dazu geklebt. Das ist das beste Medium, um es zu verbergen, weil es ist sehr... Oh, Also das ist das Original, die Seite 1 von dem Reisepass. 
aus. Er lässt gemäß dem Entschlusse des Königs, den Gott erhalten möge, dem Herrn Alexander Friedrich Freiherrn von Humboldt, Oberbergrat seiner Majestät des Königs von Preußen, zugestatten, in Begleitung seines Gehilfen und Sekretärs Alexander Bonplan nach Amerika und anderen überseeischen Besitzungen seines Reichs zu gehen, um seine bergmännischen Studien fortzusetzen und für den Fortschritt der Naturwissenschaften wertvolle Sammlungen, Beobachtungen und Entdeckungen zu machen, dass sie besagtem Herrn Alexander Friedrich Baron von Humboldt auf seiner Reise kein Hindernis in den Weg stellen, noch ihn aus irgendeinem Grunde am Transporte seiner physischen, chemischen, astronomischen und mathematischen Instrumente und Apparate noch an der Anstellung der Beobachtungen und Experimente, die er für gut hält, noch am freien Sammeln von Pflanzen, Tieren, Samen und Steinen, noch an astronomischen Beobachtungen in keinem der genannten Gebiete hindern. Ja, schön. Das ja, kann man nicht klagen, weil das tolle Wetter eigentlich auch. Das ist ein Gesicht, weil ich finde schon nicht super. Then we traveled further south. Founded in the 16th century, Cuenca is the cultural capital of Ecuador. Like Quito, Cuenca's historic center is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The prestigious buildings are built in the so-called Republican style of the 19th century. Cuenca also has many churches. The Catholic Church is very dominant in Latin America. This bridge is dedicated to the many hundreds of women murdered as a result of domestic violence. Ecuador has the sad distinction of an extremely high femicide rate. In Cuenca as well, we found the graffiti fascinating. Since May 2020, Cuenca even has a tram. The highlight of a trip to Cuenca is a visit to the Hat Museum. Here you can see how a Panama hat is made. Cerramos 
Sombreros personalizados 30 minutos. Hola, besondere extra, extra, extra modelo. 30 minutos. Ah, sale con la forma. Ah, forma, forma, la talla. Vamos a tocar un poco. At the local market, we got the impression that Ecuadorians eat a lot more meat than we do. Yo no le dije ni córtele ahí. Usted, usted calculó. Puede pedir un favor. Every Tuesday, you can be healed by shamans. Especially children are brought here. The shaman divines the patient's health from an egg. Quite innocent fun. Oh, uh, das riecht aber stark. In the evening, there are grilled guinea pigs for those who like them. A typical meal in the Andes for 5,000 years. <laughs> this is how our stay in Cuenca came to an end with street music and an ice cream.